Hey everybody, I'm here to show you how to format your USB to put the custom background on your Xbox. You can see what it looks like in the background right now. We want to go all the way over to settings, system, go down to storage. Sorry about that. Go all the way down to the bottom one where you plug the USB in. You need one gig or a two gig USB. One gig is minimal. You can have up the highest you want. All the links be in the description. Sorry, I'm doing a voice over this. To some reason didn't record the mic. Format it or make it custom size. Anyone works. And yeah, that how you do the first part. All right, guys, we're here on the screen. I have photos in that. I already have four videos. I'm gonna take the USB from the Xbox and put it in our computer right now. After you format it to the USB format for the Xbox, you know how you can make more storage. It's pretty simple. All right, now, while we're here, we want to get Horizon. Um, the link be in the description. I'm gonna go to the website real fast to show you what it looks like. This is Ryzen. This lets you mod your avatar achievement, game tools, a bunch of stuff, money, um, avatar rewards, yeah, and on. Alright, this is what you guys want. We're opening it. You can get a paid description monthly, five dollars, or you can do a free one. In these backgrounds, what we already be using, I already made this. If you download backgrounds, um, you will have to be 1080p. I'm gonna be putting a link in the description for Google. You guys can, oh, um. I guess I'm downloading it for an update. You guys can go download or type in 1080p, 720. You want at least the perfect size. And yeah. If you guys can look up transparent icons, be a second tutorial of me. All right, here it is. I'm gonna be installing it for update. You just update it. I show you guys how to make cool backgrounds and that pretty soon. This is just a fast tutorial. Me, sorry, I'm messing up if I do. <laughs> Let's launch. I just bought a HD splitter. Should be here by the 26 or something this month. Um. I'll show you what it is. It's this. I need it for the PS3. To some reason, my AV cable is not working with my capture card, and I can use it for the Xbox and that and PC, where I can just push the button to switch. Later on, they get a wireless one. All right. So you plug your USB in. Here it is. Now we want to go to. Sorry. Just give me a second. Tools. Fiend Creator, it will open. This is free, and we will be loading a image. Um, let's do this one. This is the main screen where you've seen my when the main lobby game lobby. Let's do this one and. All right, and. Actually, I want to do that one for those. Of course, these gears work. And I do music for a music one. If I can find one. Um, YouTube. <laughs> there. The system would be a. Mm, mm -hmm. Let's 
system system a troller I guess there um after that you want to name it um hmm. beyond DDO or YouTube hmm Oh no. Alright. Um save. Video. Oh shit. Oh, I messed up. Sorry guys. <laughs> the ID all. There. Save. And right there. Now let's go it's created. Back. Open your storage. Right here, you want to inject folder, and let's find what we made. Oh, video, 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 video. How's your guys this day? Please put it in the comments description. Um, does bring out the happiness in me. If you like, please like and subscribe. Here is. Now we're done. We're just gonna do this and we will be unplugging it now. Stop the recording. Let's go to the next part to the Xbox. Hey everybody, my name is Killinger. Here's the other part. Now this is how you change your theme after you put it in. You want to go over to social, go over to your avatar profile just let you know I'm doing a voiceover to this does it didn't recur in mic change theme and you can actually go through the themes you have and you can click the one you name my is my cousin theme I made this a while ago and yeah now this is the main menu what it looks like you go to games it will change and settings it will change and other settings will change um I just want to let you know what it looks like and yep now we go to your settings and after I go through this go to system go to storage well like storage go to your USB where you put the theme in the custom one you made you want to drag it over to your one of your main hard drives copy it or move it that how you add your custom theme